Hi. I had this idea running through my mind that my thesis could be the scenario of a superhero comic. Until one of those stories where heroes with superpowers are doing some incredible things. The superheroes in my thesis are some tiny little bacteria. And what's their superpower? Well, they can produce solid mineral crystals out of liquid urea. And yes, urea is exactly what you think it is, and it's produced daily by all of us, well, especially after a couple of beers. So you're probably wondering what I'm doing here with this mysterious combination of bacteria, urea, and mineral crystals. To be honest, I was wondering the same at the beginning of my thesis, but today I have a clear answer. What I'm trying to do is simply turn sands into stones. And now I will explain to you why. You see, I'm a civil engineer, and my job is to ensure your safety, which depends on the stability and integrity of all types of structures around you. And do you know where all this starts from? It starts from the foundations and the surrounding soils. Some soils are good and strong, and others are less resistant. So, so far, a common practice was to strengthen weaker soils by mixing them with cement. But practically, this replaces natural ground with concrete. Now, take a look at our cities out there. Concrete is already everywhere above the surface. My thesis introduces an alternative natural mechanism for stabilizing soils, which starts from breathing, living bacteria. And bacteria love soils. It's where they create their communities. Some of them, when fed with urea, produce an environment where mineral crystals start growing. Now, imagine my two fists are two tiny grains of sand. As crystals grow, they fill the gaps between sand grains, blocking any movement or sliding. And this results into a stronger, much more stable soil to build on. This is the biosandstone. So you see, we can inspire from nature and give answers to human problems. And this is where I found my biggest motivation for carrying out this thesis. Now, my work can be condensed in just three words. Understanding, testing, and predicting. First, I tried to understand how crystals change the soil microstructure. Then, I simply break this by sandstone to test its resistance, because my ultimate goal is to predict its final behavior. You see, as civil engineers, we want to predict everything. We work with the worst-case scenarios, because after all, we're talking about people's safety here, remember? Now, there's something sad that I kept for the end. During this process, the bacteria die. They are trapped in the crystals they created. I would say these bacteria are giving their lives for a greater cause, for supporting the safe implementation of human projects. But after all, giving your life for a greater cause is exactly what all true heroes do in comics, right? Well, I told you, I have to do with real superheroes in my thesis. Thank you very much for your attention.